You give me those pictures or I'll kill you, I swear. I don't believe you. I don't think you have what it takes to murder somebody in cold blood. Don't I? I'm not going to let you destroy my marriage, Ivy. Now you give me those pictures of me and Julian. No. Not until you've agreed to help me win back Sam. Never. This is not the way to solve our problems, Eve. The only problem I have is you, Ivy. Now give me those pictures. <laughs> Think about it. Is your friendship with Grace really worth all of this? Now just put the gun away. I am not going to betray my friendship with Grace, so give it up, Ivy, and give me those pictures. I'm sorry I can't do that. Those photos are the only leverage I have to make you do what I want. Do you think that Julian wants those pictures floating around? Your husband is going to find them and destroy them just as soon as they drag your dead body out of this house. Maybe. Maybe, maybe, but then you know what? Sam would investigate and you would go to prison. No, I won't. Oh, haven't you heard? There's a burglar in Harmony. He's killed twice already. Just make it look like you were his latest victim. No one will ever suspect me. No, no, Julian would know it was you. Julian can't say anything to anybody without implicating himself. You think he'll miss you when you're gone, Ivy? I don't think so. Okay. Think about it, Eve. Really, just think about it. What, what is more important to you? Your best friend or your family? I mean, if I have to show TC these photos, your marriage, it's going to be over. <laughs> You know, your girls, they're going to hate you. They're going to think of you as a slut and a tramp. Without you there to guide them, to look up to, you, you know, one of them surely is going to follow in your footsteps. No, never. My girls are good girls. They've been taught right from wrong. And, and they have too much self-respect to ever allow themselves to, to be treated the way that I was. How much respect can they have for themselves with you as their role model? But they're innocent. They... They haven't even had boyfriends yet. I've been very careful with them. Because of your past. Because of what you did when you were young. I may have done things in my past that I'm not proud of. But I've never been evil like you. You deserve to die. Don't make me do this, Ivy. Give me those pictures. No. What have I done? Open up! Police! Come on, open up! Oh, open that up, is please. Sam! If he sees you anything about them, everything will come out. I said open up! Open up! Ivy, are you alright? Oh, Sam, what a, what a nice surprise! Oh, Ivy, thank goodness. I mean, we heard what we thought sounded like a gunshot. Oh, is that why you were knocking so loudly? Yeah, who fired the shot? Well, why don't you come on in? Oh. Are you alone? Um, yes, yeah, yeah. I know I heard a gun go off. So why don't you tell me what happened here? It, <laughs> it is the silliest mistake. I, um, I was looking for something in Julian's desk. I found his gun, and I thought it was far too dangerous to just leave it lying there, so I decided to put it someplace more safe, and, um, it went off. It went off? Yes, yes, look. <sighs> Luckily, um, there was no one else in the room, and the only thing I managed to hit was a pillow. <laughs> I already put the gun in the safe. <sighs> well, thank goodness it was just an accident. Yes, yes, well, thank you for being so concerned, Grace. Um, Ivy, could I use your phone? I should really check at home. Oh, certainly, yes. Use the one in the foyer. <sighs> okay. So why don't you tell me what really happened here?
Those doors are open. Was somebody just here? <laughs> oh, Sam. You know, you have such a policeman's mind, and, uh... Ooh, the body to go with it. It's even more wonderful than when we were young. I thought you got over those crazy dreams of yours of us getting back together again. No, I haven't. Listen, don't do this, Ivy, all right? You know how I feel. There's no way that we're ever going to get together again. Hey. Well, everything's okay at home. Good. Did you tell Ivy about the burglar? Um, oh, oh you didn't have to. I, I heard about it earlier. <laughs> uh, let's go, honey. Everything's fine here. Okay. Well, I'm glad you're okay, Ivy. Thank good night. You. Oh, good night. Well, Eve, it's your move. <laughs>